Today we are talking with the doctors from Stem Cell Arts that are going to tell us all about exciting new breakthroughs in the treatment of pain. Take a look. Hi, my name is Mayo Friedlis and I'm a physician at National Spine and Pain's Stem Cell Arts program. Stem Cell Arts is a regenerative medicine program. Regenerative medicine is a new branch of medicine that deals with having the body try and heal itself. We're using it for pain Instead of giving people pain shots, we're actually trying to heal the parts that are broken or degenerated. So we treat a lot of different things using platelets and stem cells, which your own body can produce. And if properly harnessed, we can have great outcomes in making you feel better and be able to do a lot of things that you couldn't do before or keep doing things that you like to do. I'm going to talk about some of the ways that we do this. We have an in-house laboratory and we have some procedure rooms that are very specialized. I'd like to introduce Dr. Rodney Dade. He's going to tell you about what kinds of things we treat here at Stem Cell Arts, what kinds of things respond really well to the treatments that are regenerative in nature. All of these treatments, by the way, are to help you avoid surgery and to give you a more long-standing improvement than perhaps medicines might be able to give you. Thank you, Dr. Friedless. What do we treat here at Stem Cell Arts? Simply, we treat from the head to the toe. Let's take a look. Head and neck pain, we treat quite often. That's one of our more common things. And remember, we treat with non-surgical treatments. Down to the spine, we treat the lumbar region uh, into the hip area. Again, we're treating with regenerative treatments, uh, PRP, prolotherapy, uh, stem cells, those are things that are very applicable to the spine. Also, we treat smaller joints, the shoulder, elbow, hand and wrist, very common problems, very amenable to treatment with stem cell art treatment options. Hip and knee, probably two of our most common things that we treat. We treat labral tears, bursitis, hamstring injuries, along with osteoarthritis for both joints. Foot and ankle, again, treatment options are available here at Stem Cell Arts. Every day, patients ask me, what makes stem cell arts better? What's the key to their regenerative medicine to give us better outcomes? And the number one thing is to have the best sample possible of your stem cells and the platelets. Isolating those cells in a laboratory and knowing exactly how many cells you have and having the perfect concentration of those stem cells and knowing how many of them are alive. Acquiring platelets for PRP in a perfect concentration and a perfect purity so we know exactly the quality of the sample and the volume of those cells is key. Most people just acquire bone marrow and platelets and spin it down in a machine and the machine plays the law of averages. Most people don't actually know how many cells they have and the quality of the stem cells that are actually placed. The next is about placement of the cells in the area that's injured. You need to know where is the injury site and getting those cells perfectly positioned under x-ray guidance or under ultrasound guidance so that you can see the injury site and place those cells perfectly where they need to be to maximize the healing process. So now you know we have to acquire great cells in order to have the best outcome. And I'm going to send you over to Dr. Newton now who's going to talk about the lab and how we actually process those cells. Hi, this is Ben Newton with Stem Cell Arts. Welcome to our lab. Uh, this is where we process your blood and your stem cells for orthopedic issues. We have a great lab set up here that we're able to be very hands-on and develop a very specific protocol for your injury. Behind me, we've got a hood here, which is to keep things clean, dry, and sterile. And we've got a, a centrifuge and some other utensils here that help us get your product specificities that we want to give you the best outcome. 